In our next problem, we're going to look at some properties for polygons. Which one of the following names a quadrilateral in which the sides that meet at each vertex have the same measure? Well, let's just kind of sketch some out. Let's start, about, start with part A, which is a rectangle. We can draw a rectangle that looks like this. So if that's the case, then if I pick this vertex, would it be true that the side that meets here vertically and horizontally, those two sides, would have the same measure? And no, that's definitely not going to work. So let's eliminate that. Let's go on to a parallelogram. We can draw a parallelogram. Remember, it just has to have opposite sides parallel. Now, the opposite sides are going to have the same length, but if I pick a particular vertex like that one, you can see that I have two sides meeting that are not the same length. So we can eliminate this. What about a trapezoid? A trapezoid requires that we have two sides that are going to be parallel to each other, but I can connect these with two other sides. And so, for instance, if I pick this vertex, we can see that this length is not going to be the same as that length. So we can draw a case which doesn't work. So the trapezoid would not have to be that particular quadrilateral. By a process of elimination, we can decide the answer must be rhombus. But let's also just recall that a rhombus is a parallelogram in which all four sides have the same measure. So at any particular vertex, we're going to have sides that meet that have the same measure. So our answer is D.